Hi, I'm Janet Skates, and I'm getting ready to take a little weekend trip. So I wanted to talk to you about how I pack my art supplies for a little getaway. Um, when I'm away, I can't obviously work on large canvas too easily, so I like to work on paper pieces that I sit and um, I doodle on these and work on these uh, pieces like this and pieces like this, just some examples when I'm watching TV or hanging out or on the airplane or something like that. And so, okay, so here's a piece that I've already done some painting on, but I haven't gone into the detailed mark making like I like to do. So this would be a piece I could take with me. I also pack um, some blank paper so that I'm ready. This is um, Fabriano Artistico paper. And so I take a pad of that with me for some pieces. I'm taking some of my journals from Michigan uh, Book Press. Um, so these are examples of the little little journals that I ordered from them and I love them. They're fabulous. I'm looking for, I just started this, this little piece. Um, there it is, hold on, there. So I just started with this one and it's tiny and it's so fun. It's strange for me to work on something small because I really do like to work big. Um, and then I've got this one here that I just love another one so here is an example of i had the paint in there but then i sat and just doodled away and worked on um, adding some details to just some fun fun pages so if you've got journals this is a great thing to pack as well and now i want to talk about supplies that i take so i have a set of like 100 tombow markers i love tombow markers they're fabulous but i just pack like three to take with me um and I just randomly pick colors. Usually I go toward my favorites. I randomly pick colors, so I have to use what I have on hand. So I like doing that. And then I take my my Ever Ready uh, Stabilo pencils that I have to have. If you know me, you know about my Stabilo pencils. And I have my sharpener somewhere here, but I can't see it right now. Um, and then, oh, here it is. Here's my sharpener. I take my little sharpener. And then I've got a few different uh, Derwent ink tints pencils and a couple of other Stabilo pencils, just random colors. Um, I take some jelly pens because they're super fun to doodle with. And I take uh, uh, just an assortment of some smaller brushes and a few colors of paint. Not too many because I don't want to really get into painting, but I need some just to add some color. So I've got just a couple of fluorescents and a couple of colors here. Then I take my um, Posca pens. This is just a small assortment of all of my Posca pens, but I have to have my Posca pens because I love them so much. And so I always take several black and white because I go through these like crazy. So I've got some, even some new ones still in the wrapper and then just an assortment of medium and the larger um, tips. And then my most important, baby wipes and yes I do recommend Huggies um, not because I get any money from Huggies I don't I give them a lot of money but Huggies are awesome and if you try a, an off-brand or a little you know like Target brand or something nothing against Target but if you try those they tend to shred and get yucky on your paper Huggies holds up to the paper and the paint and I love my Huggies so I take those and that is what I do and then I have this fabulous bag that is from um, Papaya. And so I just pack everything in here and I just do like this and I'm getting ready to go actually on a trip, a road trip. So I'm just going to put all my little stuff in here and then my Posca pins and my paper, of course I pack separately because it's too big to go in my little handy bag. But my wife is fit and look here, I am ready to go. So if you get ready to travel and you wanna do some artwork on, on the road, Pack up a little bag like mine and you'll be ready. Happy fun painting!